Welcome to our webinar. My name is Tina Johnson and with me I have Dr. Chris Morris. And tonight we're going to be talking about the special proteins of STEM Renew. And special they are, not found in a lot of other uh, formulas, that's for sure. So Dr. Chris, I'm going to turn it over to you. Well, they're not found anywhere in our foods. They're just a very unique uh, ingredient we have in STEM Renew that provides them along with the other ingredients. So um, thanks so much for being on the call tonight, the webinar, and uh, we're excited to bring this topic to you. As you know, you know the body signals and communication has been so key to in the forefront of medical research from its very beginning. Just trying to understand how does the body work, and uh, it's all this interaction between the systems and these different types of organs and, and vast. Uh, vascularity, rivers of uh, you know veins and arteries and the lymphatic system which we've discovered. So all of this to combined facilitates the signaling that goes on. So the study of cell signaling touches multiple biological disciplines. But it, it just means that every aspect of science, especially medical science, the biology, the neurobiology, the endocrinology, you know, the, the signaling that goes on between the endocrine glands. So the relevance of cell communication is quite vast and it's a major area of fundamental research and um, you know oftentimes it's divided between the signals that on the cell membrane and also the study of the signals that go inside the cell, what happens inside into the nucleus and within the cell itself. But here's what's so fascinating, with STEM Renew we see the benefits in both the external and the internal communication that goes on. So this product has very unique capabilities that uh, no one else really understands. Yeah, absolutely. Um, you know, there's some products that are just focused on intercellular mm -hmm. communication or intercellular health or extracellular health, and we have both with STEM Renew. So the fact that it encompasses all aspects of cellular communication makes it very unique and special. So um, this, this is so important to understand. Nutrition that supports the engineering design of life is coded in our genes where this signaling has to happen. We're talking about the basic chemistry of life that we facilitate. But you know, let's start at the beginning here. Before we're physical, you know, we're really an energetic being and I just, I love this painting because it's just so expansive and showing the dynamics of all the energies that exist in the body, the meridians, the chakras, the nadis, all the different uh, forces that are energetically designed, you know, within the heart, within the muscles, within the nerves. So we're energy first and it's these energy packets that come together as light and electrons that make up the molecules and the molecules are what make up the, the tissue and the tissue makes up the organs and the systems and, and you've heard us over and over again how we have this um, you know cascade of, of interaction that happens within a hierarchy of the body. So we're really looking at energy that's captured in a physical form and that's what we're we're going to be talking about today how this signaling facilitates not only this uh, physical communication but the energetics that go on because these signals are very unique and special the way they're designed. So let's take a look at our cell, that, that fundamental lowest common denominator component in the body that has to make the energy for the body to work, that has to uh, essentially make the proteins that uh, we're talking about that do all this signaling and communication. So your health, your energy, the future of your well-being can all be found within the core of the cell. And um, when we talk about it today, we're looking at the surface where you have receptor sites that snag on or capture the signals and those signals are then communicated through the surface of the cell and then into the various organelles or the nucleus where the genetic blueprint is or the mitochondria where the energy factories are, are designed to make energy and facilitate our, our, our life. 
uh, or within the circulatory system that exists in the cell where all these um, proteins are made. If you look at those um, little orange dots, those of you that have the graphic up there, those orange uh, little spheres, those are what we refer to as the uh, part of the immune system. This is the, the lysosome. So you have communication happening with enzymes. And then you have those little blue dots that are throughout the inside of the cell. And those are the ribosomes. Those are the energy factories that make the proteins. So you see that there's an incredible orchestration that's going on within the cell. And um, what we're going to do is focus on three specific areas that STEM Renew facilitates, but these three areas are the cornerstones of cellular communication. So when we go to the next slide, we're, we're seeing the science of proteomics. And what does that mean? It's the science of proteins, right? And the science of proteins start out with the stem cell as it makes proteins it not only um, makes other cells, but also makes these signal molecules that facilitate the communication that goes on throughout the body. So you see this picture of a stem cell spewing out these molecules, but those are the signal proteins, and they're very unique. They're the ones that fit on the surface of the cell, and also the ones that help the cell manufacture the signals that go on within the cell. And this is the science of proteomics. So, Tina, let's talk a little bit about what we know about the embryonic extract that we have in STEM Renew. It's a very unique formula because it's pre-embryonic. So pre-embryonic means that before life has taken on these signals in order to make the organs and the systems within the embryo, we capture them between the ninth and 10th day in order to facilitate our own regeneration and repair. It's interesting because when you look at the egg physiology and the studies show that um, the, the weight or, or the composition of the embryo is only about 10% formed, but then after the 11th and 12th day, we see a sharp increase in the activity it actually increases by almost a thousand percent or more and you see this rapid development of the body. So what caused that rapid development? It's these signal proteins that have been infused into the embryo. So here's what's so special for everyone out there, whether you have an imbalance with the nervous system, the endocrine system, the immune system, all of the systems that are designed to be created in life these are the proteins that facilitate the creation of these systems, the creation of the organs, the creation of the tissue. So we're capturing these very unique molecules that facilitate that. And they're primarily proteins, and this is why they're a big part of the study of proteomics. So think about every time you take STEM Renew, you're ingesting a whole concentration of these very unique signal proteins that facilitate the communication within your own body and looks for ways for it to you know, rejuvenate and repair itself. And the signaling, a lot of the signal, signaling has declined as we age. So when we introduce that back into our body, it wakes it up in so many different multidimensional ways. And that's where we can see and, uh, and it facilitates um, the, the reorganizing or the rebalancing of the body. And that's so important, Tina, because it's introducing not only these very unique proteins that are in the pre-embryonic stage, but the specific ones that are missing in the body, especially as we age, we even lose the ones that are there for you know, adult regeneration and repair. So these are very unique and able to start things over from scratch. Now, let's look at the second phase of this uh, medical research that's going on. And you've all heard us talk about the future of medicine is based around regenerative medicine, on renewal science, the stem cell system. So when you look at STEM Renew and its ability to facilitate the activation of our stem cells, 
now you're seeing an incredible activation of your renewal system. But remember from the first slide, we talk about stem renews designed to help the production of stem cells in the, you know, the bone marrow. The release of those stem cells through the immune factors that we facilitate and then the activation. And uh, the unique aloe vera we have has been shown to stimulate and increase as much as 200% of the stem cell activity in our body. So a uh, very unique approach. So the stem cell can differentiate itself into any other type of tissue. It makes another stem cell and it has the ability to be anti-inflammatory and um, fight apoptosis, which means uh, cell death. Those are the things that are the regulatory dynamics of stem cells and the signaling. So um, let's take it to the next area, which is very critical to everyone as we age, and it's, it's the immune system. And if you look again at each of the ingredients in Stem Renew, you have the shark cartilage and, and the aloe, which facilitate an anti-inflammatory dynamic, help release the pain and inflammation. You have the green tea extract and the aloe vera that facilitate antioxidant uh, potential in the body. As a matter of fact, not only do they function as antioxidants, but they enhance the, the other antioxidants that we ingest, like the vitamin C and vitamin E that we take in, in our supplementation or our foods. And then there's the marine minerals. These are very special building the bones. And um, they also help balance the pH in the body. When you balance the pH, you create a hostile environment for microbes. So the, the bad guys don't proliferate and, and uh, attack the body. So you have these uh, aloe vera long chain polysaccharides that, that are antimicrobial. And then you have the marine minerals that create an environment that don't even allow these um, microbials to infest the body or to uh, proliferate. And then once again, we're looking at immune modulation. All that means if its immune system is working too hard or too fast and too hot, it cools it down. If the immune system is too slow and sluggish and cold, it speeds it up. And so it modulates it. And this is the beauty of natural substances, their ability to you know, no, to turn on and to turn off according to the, the balance and required. Because the, the body knows. Exactly. Right. And nature knows like the body knows, and that's what we're talking about. Exactly. So without getting too technical here, this is, this is what we're trying to describe to you, these very unique proteins. And this is why we say ingredients matter. Ingredients matter because these proteins aren't denatured, they're still in their living form. And we capture them in a very unique way so that they can be ingested into the body and released and facilitate this wonderful dynamic that goes on with signaling and communication. Now, what's very special is that because this composition of proteins comes from nature, it has the ability to modulate because a lot of times we'll get questions about these individual signal proteins and someone will say, well, I understand FGF isn't good if you've got cancer or I understand that this isn't good if you have an autoimmune condition. And what we're trying to show here is this, this is just a small cross section of the signaling proteins, but you see they have the ability to work together and build where necessary and break down where necessary. So you have signal molecules that you know, essentially help to build the liver, kidney, and brain function. And then at the same time, you have signal molecules that help facilitate the communication of those unique organs and systems. Let me see if I understand. So when we're talking about the questions that come in, and people will ask, well, you know, I know that this particular growth hormone, uh, the IGF-1, is not good for me if I have a certain dysfunction in the body. What we're saying here is that if you isolate those particular proteins, if you take them in an isolated form, if they're not in a whole food form like like they are with Stem Renew, yes, they could be damaging. Mm -hmm. However, because we have it in a whole food supplement and it has all these incredible growth, uh, excuse me, uh, cofactors that go with 
these different proteins, they're safe. Exactly, exactly. So um, it, it is so important to really understand it because you're going to get questions about these individual molecules. And, and for the longest time, we've even hesitate to identify them and help people look at them. But then when you're talking to doctors and you're talking to individuals that are really into science, they really get excited when they see these very unique uh, proteins available from our product. So you see an athlete will see folostatin, and that's something that's used for muscle building, and it's incredible in, in helping to form the shape and, and design of tissue. And then you've got T-beta-4. Uh, we would talk to cosmetologists and, and estheticians and surgeons, and they say, wow, this is an incredible protein that we put in our formulas because it helps injured and damaged tissue. And then, then you've got, you know, the, the different type of growth factors that facilitate wound healing and facilitate uh, stem cell activation. So you see how unique these signal molecules are, and they're not available anywhere else in our food. Because how many of you are out there ingesting? <laughs> Nine-day-old. <laughs> Nine-day-old incubated. <laughs> Fertilized. Fertilized eggs, eggs, right? So, Freeze-dried. <laughs> so, Understand that we go through great effort and pains to procure this very unique formula, this ingredient from Norway where the hens and the eggs are pristine and just so healthy and strong, and they produce this wonderful ingredient for us. And then this ingredient is manufactured in a very unique proprietary way so that we can capture these proteins in their living form and facilitates this incredible magic that goes on. So understand that you have a very unique composition of ingredients that is a compilation of signals that helps the renewal system, it helps the immune system, helps the endocrine system, helps the nervous system, and all of those systems keep you healthy and strong. So as the cells have evolved, you know, and, and developed these signaling mechanisms, and how to transmit the information within the neighborhood of cells that they reside in, you're, you're seeing that all the other nutrition available from NHT is very unique in facilitating this cellular dynamic as well. You have the very special nutrients that feed the, um, let's say, the anti um, um, the system for antioxidants like the production of glutathione with the, the triotene. And then you have the decalcification of the body that happens with the restore uh, formulas. Then you have the very unique um, plant and vegetable molecules, the, the phytonutrients that come from the juices. And so uh, we can't you know, begin to uh, tell you how excited we are to see all these wonderful building blocks to be available along with STEM Renew so that STEM Renew can orchestrate the signaling and the use of these building blocks so much more effectively and efficiently. So Tina, we've got something very unique, very unique story out there to share and we're so glad people are tuned in to help learn about it. We are and thank you Dr. Chris for that great explanation of all those special proteins and how safe they are and how they how people can get it in our natural food supplement of STEM Renew. Thank you everyone for being on tonight's webinar and we'll see you again soon. Bye for now.